Good evening, myself and Post. It is Tuesday, May the 8th of May, 2012. That's the year it is. And today, I'm kind of pissed off at people just because I saw a group of people and they were all wearing the same watch. Um, this might not seem as big as a deal as m m many people, but um, it really does for me because, you know, people don't know how to think for themselves anymore. Everyone's sheep. They see someone doing something and then they do the exact same thing as they do. Uh, espe especially fashion-wise or anything, really. It can involve, it can, you know, it can vary from intensity. It goes from all, let's all wear the same stupid overpriced plastic watches to, you know, maybe, um, let's all kind of beg a 2012 year old Jewish zombie to break all the laws of chemistry, uh, physics and, you know, biology to come fix my dog's minor medical discrepancies. Um, I probably just offended a few people. I do that. I tend to do that quite a bit. I'm a dick. Get used to that. I've been neglecting these dancing flowers from the vlogs for a while because they haven't really been very cheerful. It seems to be going now. I'm not really sure of that because it's UV powered. So, and there's no sun right now. Maybe it's my uh, monitor. Who knows? This one, it's funny because this one it has a black thingy, but then the other one that I have um, has, a, has a very flamboyant thingy and its spirits are much higher than the other one. The other one will not dance very often, this one dances a little more often. And uh this one has a slight nope, it's it's comatosed. But this one it has a slight sign of life. Don't ya? That's exactly right. I also filmed this video that um John Sabo uploaded Big John um last night. And I didn't get it. Well, I filmed it, and when I was uploading stuff from my footage, at one point, all of the footage was lost. So, that's a bit of a shame, isn't it? So, yeah, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to shove the camera into the tripod, and I'm going to show you exactly what he posted. This is a little um, description as to what uh, some vitamin C can do for you. So, you need to be wary of that. So... Let's turn up the volume and get cracking. Guys, it's Big John here. So, just had a hard day at work, haven't got paid yet, so I wanted a bit of tucker, wanted a bit of dinner, wanted a bit of food up in me. So I was out in the outback of Toowoomba and I found myself a bloody great orange. And you can get an orange too. <laughs> it's quite easy. I just had to walk through some painful, stinging nettle. And as you can see, it's burnt up my legs, my pants, and my shirt. Mum's gonna kill me. And then I reached out and I grabbed an orange. Now I'm just peeling it. Now I'm eating it. There's many uses these things can do. You can just chomp it. Hey, if you're not a fan of chewing, why not have some Ogre? <laughs> great, <laughs> great stuff. Isn't it amazing what nature can provide? <laughs> and it's a great source of vitamin C. And most of all, it is free. How's that for a um, word? <laughs> Alright guys, I'm gonna let you go. This is Big John Song again. Now that prep video probably wouldn't have been as funny if it weren't for the asthma attack going on in the background. Time for widening of lenses because the lens is not wide enough. I'm gonna chuck this on, this is what you need, that's the way. I'm gonna go now, enjoy the rest of your life. Peace. Be you know, either, either one, it doesn't really matter. It's